besides being considered the goddess of pop. Cher is a powerful woman who has already amassed huge wealth throughout her life. But have you ever stopped to wonder about just how this star lives? In this video you will find out all about the luxurious life of Cher. Before we get started, I challenge you. You have to click on subscribe and activate notifications check the option all. But you have to do that in less than 5 seconds, you got it? And if you can, write in the comments hashtag about subscribe. Alright, let's get started. Career Born in 1946 in the city of El Centro, California, Sherilyn Sarkeesian, better known as Cher, is a great American songwriter, singer and actress. Even though she dreamed of being famous since her childhood, the little girl wasn't sure what her talent was. Cher gained popularity in 1965 as a member of the folk rock duo Sonny and Cher after their song I Got You Babe became a big hit. Soon after, she launched her solo career, producing hits like Bang Bang, My Baby Shot Me Down, Believe, Dark Lady, I Found Someone, If I Could Turn Back Time. For being a pioneer in the use of auto-tune and being one of the first women to enter this part of the music industry, Cher is considered the goddess of pop. As if that wasn't enough, she also became a television personality, as well as acting in 80s movies like Moonstruck and Mask. Because of her relevance in the art scene, she was granted several major awards such as one Emmy, one Grammy, one Oscar, and three Golden Globes. With an impeccable legacy, Today, at the age of 76, Cher has built up enough wealth to enjoy a considerably comfortable life. Old Mansion Cher is an award-winning artist who doesn't skimp out when it comes to choosing where to live. Her first mansion, called the Owlwood Estate, is one of the largest in Holmby Hills, near Sunset Boulevard on the west side of Los Angeles. The incredible Renaissance-style villa was built in 1936 and is 12,200 square feet in size, being itself located on a 10-acre lot. On the main level, the entrance hall dates back to the time of its construction and has a classic and elegant style. The formal dining room is next door and is highlighted by its hand-carved wooden moldings on the walls. The mansion also features a lounge with some beautiful doors and windows that bring natural light into the room, while the elegant living room has furniture from its time and a wood-paneled fireplace that make this room ideal for formal gatherings. On the upper floors is the charming master suite, where one can see the predominance of white colors and ornate plaster walls. The mansion has other equally sophisticated bedrooms, nine bathrooms with marble floors, and an office on the upper level overlooking woods. In addition to all the formal places, the mansion also has an entertainment area, which includes a pool table and bookshelves built into the walls. Something that stands out in this residence is that it even has tunnels that lead to the garden, ideal to enter and leave the house with discretion. Going outside, there are several patios for open-air resting, as well as a centralized fountain at the entrance of the mansion and a large tennis court. The property also boasts a beautiful lawn and several trees that create a tranquil atmosphere for resting close to nature. There is also a luxury pool next to a guest house, which features an outdoor patio, living room, guest bathroom, compact kitchen, and a cozy bedroom. Cher bought the mansion with her ex-husband Donnie in 1974 for $750,000, but besides them, some other famous people have lived in the place and artists have even thrown parties at the property. According to media reports, those who want to purchase the mansion will have to fork out no less than $115 million. Current Mansion Cher's current mansion, meanwhile, is located on Pacific Coast Highway near the stunning coastline of Malibu, considered one of the most sought-after destinations for famous people looking for charming and sophisticated places to live. The singer herself was the one who designed the decoration of this three-story mansion, drawing inspiration from Renaissance works, which make the property a real 19th-century palace in its every detail. Outside, meanwhile, the 13,000-square-foot mansion sits on a prime lot facing the Pacific Ocean and includes a luxury pool with infinity edges. Cher almost sold the property to Beyoncé and Jay-Z for the sum of $41 million, however the deal was not finalized. And according to some sources, the property was last listed for $45 million. Cars Cher is the more reclusive type of star, and so there is little information about her spending on cars. 
It is known that she and her late ex-husband, Sonny, had a collection of classic cars, with them buying the same models in pairs of different colors for each. An example of this was their pair of customized, sophisticated 1966 Ford Mustangs. Cher's car had its exterior, and also its interior done in pink. Meanwhile, Sonny's Mustang was yellow on the outside, with a brown interior with Jaguar print seats. A real luxury! The celebrities' cars went up for auction in 2009, being auctioned for around $200,000. The couple has also owned a luxurious Rolls-Royce Silver Wraith from the 1950s, and also a pair of Rolls-Royce Silver Cloud 3. Back then, as well as nowadays, owning a model from this British car brand is a synonym to having a lot of status and wealth. Cher has also been spotted using a Mercedes-Benz car, with everything pointing to it being a CLA Coupe model, a vehicle of athletic design that costs around $40,000. Another car belonging to the star is a Cadillac Escalade, a family-sized vehicle that features top-notch interior cladding, in addition to its rugged exterior look. And to acquire such a great car in its most complete version, you need to spend about $100,000. When she wants a sportier vehicle, Cher opts for her Porsche 911. With its timeless design, this car combines tradition and modernity. Not surprisingly, its most complete version costs around $200,000. Relationships Cher is a high-profile artist, and during the height of her fame, her personal life was always in the media spotlight. The handsome actor Warren Beatty was one of the singer's first boyfriends, with her being 16 years old at the time. After that, she lived a long love story with her stage partner Sonny Bono. The former couple married in 1964 and had their first child, Chaz Bono, five years later. After discovering cheating from her husband, they divorced in 1974. Sonny married again and again, until he died in a skiing accident in 1998. After the divorce, Cher dated David Geffen, who is currently openly gay. The star's second marriage with the rock guitarist Greg Allman in 1975, but they went apart four years later. After that, she dated the bass player from the band Kiss, Gene Simmons. There have been rumors that she has also been in a relationship with Eric Stoltz and Tom Cruise when he was 23 years old and she was 39. She really likes younger men, as at the age of 40, she met Rob Camaletti, nicknamed Bagel Boy, who was 22 years old at the time. Cher also dated the Bon Jovi guitar player, Richie Sambora, for two years, and TV executive Josh Donan, to whom she turned down a marriage proposal. Not to mention other brief relationships the singer has had. Donations If there's one thing Cher makes a point of spending her money on, it's on charity. She has her own foundation, known as Share Cares, which aims to support different causes. Her institution has already donated, for example, $130,000 for the purchase of headgear for the military troops in Iraq and Pakistan. The singer is also a big philanthropist for animal causes. She launched, for example, an institution called Free the Wild to fund the reintroduction of trapped animals to the wild. The Kavan Elephant was a successful case of rescue, a mission that cost Cher $400,000. The star even released a documentary with Paramount Plus called Cher and the Loneliest Elephant, detailing the quest to free the elephant. In September 2020, Cher raised nearly $2 million for Joe Biden's presidential campaign in an LGBTQ-themed virtual fund. Other Properties Cher also loves buying and selling high-end villas in different locations. She once owned, for example, a 3,000-square-foot property on Gloaming Drive in a quieter part of the city of Los Angeles. The home was built in 1957 and features a spacious living area next to the rustic dining room, which sits next to French-style windows. The kitchen has a clean design and includes another room for casual dining. There is also a private office, three bathrooms, and four modern bedrooms, with the master suite featuring two fireplaces and integrating a living area through an aligned classic bookcase. It also includes an elegant walk-in closet and a spacious bathroom with two sinks. Outside, there is a patio with views of the mountains, a beautiful lawn, and a lovely waterfall. According to some sources, the singer sold the property for approximately $2,500,000. The singer also once owned a duplex apartment in West Hollywood at Sierra Towers, an exclusive residential condominium located in California. The luxurious apartment is approximately 2,300 square feet, 
features a sophisticated living room that integrates the dining table that faces towards the balcony with incredible views of the city, plus a kitchen decorated with Indian paneling. The master suite is on the other floor, being decorated with Indian antiques, as well as containing yet another living room, a private bathroom and another balcony with a breathtaking view. Cher sold the duplex apartment in 2013 for $5,250,000, but the property had come back to the market in 2018, selling again for $6,995,000. The artist also had an oceanfront mansion located on La Gorse Island in Miami Beach, Florida. Located on the shores of Biscayne Bay, the 11,500-square-foot mansion features carefully designed architecture. Going indoors, we can see that the living room is done in some clean colors and features ocean views, while the formal dining room includes doors that open to the garden. The kitchen features a chef's island in the center, plus modern furniture and appliances. There is also a cozy games room so she can spend her free time. On the upper level, there are large glass windows that bring natural light into the room and the residence has six bedrooms, among them one exclusive for guests and a suite in soft colors, with top-notch furniture and a fireplace with plaster moldings. There is also a balcony overlooking the bay, six luxurious bathrooms, a modern media room, stairs leading to a lounge on the top floor, and a sophisticated bar next to a shelf of spirits. Outside, Cher had a true paradise at her disposal, with the grounds extending to a private pier, as well as containing several patios and a pool to enjoy the sunny Miami weather. According to the Los Angeles Times website, the property was sold in 2020 for $17 million. Another property Cher once owned in Beverly Hills was a sophisticated mansion on Benedict Canyon Drive, a prime neighborhood where other celebrities reside. Built by the singer in the late 1970s, the mansion boasts a total of 20,000 square feet of living space within a large four-acre plot of land. Aside from the tiled-walled living room, little is known about its interior, but the outside of the mansion features woods, riding trails, and a large tennis court. The mansion is part of its own equestrian center, next to an enchanting waterfall. It also has an infinity pool, a sculpture in its garden, and several relaxing patios with lovely views of the region. Cher lived in this place for a few years, until she sold it in 1988 for $5,900,000 to actor Ed Murphy. And according to some sources, the mansion was last put up for sale in 2016 for $85 million. Net Worth Cher has been making a lot of money from her stardom since the 1960s, with her totaling nearly 60 years in her career, it's been long enough to amass a giant net worth. Coming from a time when record sales were a very popular thing, the singer sold 40 million copies with her duo and then 100 million in her solo career. In addition, Cher was a great success story when it comes to her concerts. She signed a contract in 2008, for example, for a three-year concert residency in Las Vegas, pocketing $60 million at the time. Meanwhile, her big tour lasted from 2002 to 2005, being known as Living Proof, the farewell tour. It became one of the highest-grossing tours of all time, earning $250 million. As early as 2014, Forbes magazine listed her as the 23rd highest-grossing touring artist since 1990, with total revenue of $351,600,000. Her stardom in television and movies also represented great earnings for the artist. All this without mentioning her income from her commercial image, with her participating in various advertising campaigns, such as for Versace. To this day Cher sells licensed products, such as perfumes from her brand. And a great way to promote them is on her Instagram, where she has over 2,200,000 followers. Currently, some sources estimate Cher's net worth to be at $360 million, but she is likely to be much wealthier. Hey, you like the video? So don't forget about leave your like and comment, and tell some suggestions of another videos, and hopefully we gonna do it. All about channel, deals to satisfy your curiosity.